said, he said it's like toys. I'm like, okay. Oh, he didn't say that. He said toys. Oh. That, so, <clears throat> he told me. Where do you tell you to take the boxes to? For, can you tell me, can I go? You're taking 115 pounds of toys to Knoxville? How much were you going to receive for these toys, huh? Huh? How much were you going to receive for these toys? I want to know how much you thought you were going to receive for these toys. What is up, YouTube? It is your boy, Texas Chris, coming back again with another video. And today, Ace by Title, we'll be reacting to Truck Driver Gets Busted with 115 pounds of that white powder. Of that white powder. Not no plant of that white powder. Let's get right into it. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Let's check it out. On January 9th, 2022, police noticed a truck speeding by with heavily tinted windows. A traffic on, stop bro. was quickly initiated. You can't be around with what transpired windows. was insane. Here's the video. Carrying that stuff. Tripping. Keep it under 65, all right? I did. <laughs> We're going 70 there in the left lane. All right, bro. Five over. Come on now. I know it's different for 18 wheels and stuff like that, but five over. Come on now. You gotta be bored. I just mind. I was trying to get you uh, past my hold on to. So this is your truck? Company truck, sir. Oh, so you drive for these guys? Yes, sir. You got a registration? Yes, sir. How long you been driving for these guys? Uh, just not long. You by yourself in there? Yes, sir. Can I see the back? Yeah, go ahead. Nothing. Anybody else? No, sir. You yeah, got no registration, sir? So you said you've been with him how long now? Uh, just a year, sir. One year? Yes, sir. Okay. Oh, I know his heart that? shivering. One, one truck, that's it? Yes, sir. What's inside the trailer? It's empty. No, no load? It's empty. I'm going to a repair shop. Okay. Yeah. Going to Greenwood. So you have nothing in the trailer? No. What do you have a seal on? You just put the seal on, that's it. But there's no load? All right, that don't make sense. Oh, I know a little bit about trucking. That don't make sense. My trailer. Well, what happened? They they unhooked the bolt. Okay. Did they put something in there? No. Okay. Yeah. I just put it. You know, so they won't open it. I got you. All right. So you have your logbook, sir? My logbook, right? So uh, where did you drop off your last load? Uh, so I went to Houston. So they couldn't repair it. They didn't have the part. So I'm going to Indianapolis. They have the part over there. So you drove empty from Houston? Yes, sir. What kind of part are you looking for? I'm looking for um, the gasket. There was like major leaks. As you can see, you hear it? I don't. Which gasket? <laughs> uh, <laughs> he said I don't. Kind of gasket? Okay, so you were down there with the load in Texas or no? No. What were you doing down there? Looking for parts. So you drove from New York to Texas? No. Okay. I started from Virginia. With the load? No. So you drove this truck? So off? I went to I went to Knoxville and I was supposed to replace it but some other driver took it because I was supposed to lease it. Lease what? The truck. Okay. So you went to Knoxville and you delivered the load in Knoxville? No. So I he's supposed to lease a truck that's owned by the company? I'm confused. I'm getting real confused now. He's not making much sense to me. Drop this truck for repair, but they said that it's gonna take a month for them to fix this. Wow! So then the company told you to drive it to Texas? Yes, sir. So you couldn't find a part in Texas? Yeah. So I've, last part I found was in Ohio, and that so was my. Uh, there's no way you can find one company part that you need in Texas. There's no way. They're having you drive around the country to find parts. No, I mean that's just this time, you know. I mean it okay. was going fine, you know, but. I'm having like yeah. problems with this. You can already so, tell he's lying. I'm trying to find the part so I can keep it going so I don't have to like sit at home for like a couple months. But this is a company truck. Yeah. I don't wanna I don't wanna go and you know, go with another company, you know, when I'm like already with this company. Okay. So why couldn't they just call Texas before you drove all the way down there? They did. They said they have it and then when I got there, they said that hey, it's on back order. Really? So I called over here now. I told them, hey, check if you have it on hand, you know. Okay. They said they have it, so that's where I'm going to. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and do an inspection. Do you mind coming back here with me, sir? Yeah, sure. Uh, just come off this side. Go. Hey, sir, what are you doing? What are you doing? Huh? Why are you locking the truck? I'm not locking it. I'm just getting the keys so it doesn't get locked. Yeah, I don't get locked. You're just locking it. I unlock it. Yeah, I see you pulled uh, another truck over there. I sure did. Yeah. That's my job. That's, <laughs> that's what they took off right there. What? So some driver took took this bolt off. Uh-huh. So my trailer was down and I was having a major leak. So 
so that's what you're looking for? No, I already, already got that fixed. So, what part is it again? so there's yeah, another yeah. part he needs. The seal. No. Okay. It's a, it's a gasket. Have a seat up front. What? His door is not there's matching. No load in there. I open for you. That's cold. I think you about to give me some money, man. I don't have enough for me, man. I gotta keep what I what I got. How long were you down in Texas? Like a day. And they couldn't find you a load down there to pull no. back? Uh, at least pay for the fuel? I mean, they, they pay. I mean, they're paying for the fuel, so. So they're paying for the fuel from, basically from Virginia yeah. to Knoxville. To Texas. Houston, yeah. And then back. Yeah. So are they losing a bunch of money on this trip? Yeah, they are. Yeah. Well, why would they do that? I don't know. I mean, they're trying to get this. Bro, he's money. not making they're sense at all. Business running? Yeah. So we got an appointment in Indy. Yeah. And they got the park? Yeah. They're going to fix it this time? Or? I don't know. So what I don't understand is that wouldn't it be better for this trucking company, you, the people that are To get another truck, truck wouldn't or it trailer? Be better to just ship the park? Yeah, but that it's on back order, so it, it's going to take like months, you know? Then why even drive? I'm trying to look for like parts. Okay. <laughs> you know, that's why I found it. I called a lot of places. So what he's doing is not for work for responsibility or the no, i mean that's companies but All right but i don't want that burden on you yeah basically okay. it sounds like a money wasting operation to me <laughs> it is so who, who's the owner of the company it's uh miss car miss car she's the one that hired you yeah what's her first name man pre <clears throat> can i just be straight up with you man yeah i i don't know what's going on here but it's <clears throat> not truck <clears throat> can i just be so because you know it's it, do you, do you understand where I'm coming from? Yeah, 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 yeah. Is that 11 at night and it's still sun out? As, as far as truck drivers go, okay. uh, I'm not saying anything personal against you. I'm just saying. This camera must be on. You know what I mean? It just, camera yeah, time. It just doesn't feel right right now. So, all right. That's a part of my job is to confirm that there's nothing illegal going on. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let me call it. Uh, Mr. Uh, what's the... I'm staying here, son. Yeah, that's all good. What are you calling her for? Hey, why are you calling her for? What's that, sir? Why are you calling her for? No, I'm because I gotta, I gotta ask like, if we can, if we can do all this. Hello? Is that the owner? Yeah, yeah, she said that if you can, I can take a picture of this, send it to her. Yeah, if, come on in, man. Why are you out there? Freezing. Just read this. If you give me permission, I'll have you sign right here. You don't need her permission. Oh, okay. But you're a grown man. Or... <laughs> No, nah, he's no trolling. Uh, I mean, I'm empty, you know, but I don't have anything. But you know, you just stop me for inspection. <laughs> What's wrong with that? Nothing's wrong with that, you know. I am gonna break that seal, so yeah, that's fine. I can break it for you, you know. I just put that on because because you know somebody was messing with my trailer. I'll be right back. <laughs> Hey, what are you doing? I was gonna break that seal for you. Stay back there. Hey, stay back there. Okay. Can you open the right door for me, please? You better call K9. It's hard to get you out here, but You're good. there's a box in the cab with a blanket over it. You put the seal in on this trailer with no load. Going from Virginia to Texas back to find parts. It's not even this truck. Is that a state trooper? You got a city cop. Hey, sir, sir, come on out. We'll finish up in a minute. Woo! Hey, what's going on? He's just going to run a dog around the vehicle. You want to sit in my car? Yeah, he's cooked. He's cooked. You good? Hey, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, the dog alerted to the owner of narcotics in your truck, so we're going to go ahead and search it, okay? So we're going to put you in this vehicle in the meantime. Uh, you go with him, okay? Here it comes, son. I wonder how many oh Ooh. yeah he's cooked I wonder how many trucks I've actually do that though. Hey, nice right, kilos. 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 Yep, duff him up. Uh, okay. Oh, he's he locked in there, right? Yeah, I don't okay. Like cuffs. Alright. <laughs> yeah, boy. Two, looks like coat today. two boxes. Yeah. I'm glad you're glad you're here. Yo oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm glad to be here. This is a nice truck inside, huh? This is nice. Alright, looks like both boxes are gonna be loaded. I'm sure he's been on the phone with someone already. Yeah, he's still on the phone. I'm gonna go take that phone. Yeah. Use my customer. Yeah, yeah. 
Oh, have a seat in there, bro. Go for him. Yo, like, but do you actually think, like, that was, like, his day-to-day -day job is just traffic? Yeah. You want to stay here? I'll toss it to you. Like, traffic narcotics. I was not traffic in the trailer, but... Yeah, they're pretty heavy. Huh? Yeah, probably. All right. Ah. Somebody gives me time for that. Sport the red, white, blue in here. Yeah. When I, uh... I got in here. I saw it said O'Reilly Auto Parts, and he's been talking this story about shopping for parts. I'm like, oh shit. <laughs> it's Auto Parts. <laughs> That's not Auto Parts. I see, man, I got you out here for no reason. Nah, I felt bad. So. Oh no, you're good. Who? He said he was going to Indianapolis. So. Who? Cooperate, that'd be awesome. Yeah, who knows who he called already? Right, right, right. What do you think of this? I'm telling you. Like coke. Yeah. Who knows? Probably a hundred, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Maybe. This box is probably 80 pounds. Oh, my goodness, bro. He's cooked. He's cooked. He's cooked. They got a workout in for today. That's 115 pounds. They got a workout in. I wonder if there's more. That's a workout, dude. All right, that's what I said. He stole my line. Well, am I glad you was at home? I know you've been on the phone back and forth during this stop here, but you want to cooperate? Or can you come and help me? Well, have you made contact with the receiver of the drugs since, since I stopped here today? I mean, I don't, I don't even know like what was in the boxes. Okay. Buddy, buddy told me, you know, get this over here. I buddy was like, in Texas. Or yeah. Where? So I was like, okay, you know. So, so we just. I didn't, I didn't even know like what was, what was like, you know, in the box. Okay. But I, I mean, everybody gonna say that, so they're not gonna believe it. I'm like, I'm so, so do you know? You said narcotics, so I was like, okay. He said narcotics to you. Yeah. So I was like, why'd you take? I didn't know what the hell oh, was the box. Buddy. He said it's like toys. And I'm like, okay. Oh, he didn't say that. He said toys. Oh. Yeah. So he told me. Where do you no, tell you no. to take the boxes to? For, can you tell me? Can I go? You're taking a hundred and fifteen pounds of toys to Knoxville. How much were you gonna receive for these toys, huh? How much were you going to receive for these toys? I want to know how much you thought you were going to receive for these toys. Because those toys ain't cheap, brother. <laughs> those I'm toys ain't cheap. Right I'll tell you. I'm going to tell you if you tell me I can leave. If you want to help yourself out and drive them. You're not leaving right now, bro. You're not leaving. Them to the person You're not leaving. Receive them. We can do that. If you're willing to, I just need to know if you made contact with anybody since and I stopped you. That wouldn't be up to me at that point. I'm willing to cooperate. If you so willing you're willing to, to make a delivery to take the drugs on to the receiver? Yes. Who, uh, if you are willing to cooperate with me, okay. well, it's, well, if, it, you, if I can leave, it works the other way around, buddy. Okay. Sir, so, <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> freaking boxes, okay? Hold on. Just hold These on. just set me up now. So uh, no, you said so. When I come to you. It was my buddy. Buddy that gave you the box? No, no, no. It was my uh, buddy from Virginia. You've been trying to call your boss. You said your boss. Yeah. So somebody knows you've been stopped, right? So I need to know, do the people that are responsible for the dope, for the drugs in there, do they know that you've been stopped? Since I stopped you an hour ago, have you made contact with them? I know you've been on your phone quite a bit. Yeah, I think we're done, man. I, uh, I was, I was going to tell you. What are you going to tell me? I'm going to cooperate with you. I have, I have a setup. Okay, what's the setup? So, these folks over here. Over where? Close by. Where's close by? you got to be Indy. specific. Indy. Okay. So, okay. I can I can, I can give you, I can cooperate. Please, like, like, I'll have to set up, man. Can I, can you, can I leave those for you? You're going with them for now. Yeah, for now. Yep. This, these things take time, okay? Yep. So, Bro, he know. is cooked. Like, he's going to see some time. That's a uh, lot. No, no. Right now, I don't know who you're going to call. Your wife could be involved. I don't know that. She's not involved. 
Uh, I, I don't think this is going to work, so we're just going to cancel it. I don't think you're being truthful with me. So. I am. That don't sound like it. Sir, I am, for real. Yeah. I, just, I just got set up here. I'm going to run you up to the jail, okay? Yes, sir. Yes. Help me. I can help you. Please. I think he got him sitting in the front seat. Nothing covering the back. That's crazy. There's no transport the or nothing. And that's spoiling the operation. So we can't mm -hmm. use it, it, it. It's not. I can help you guys for real. You guys gotta trust me. So I, I cause you know I'll. Man, I'm gonna tell you one thing. Up. Law enforcement don't trust nobody except other law enforcement. I'm just being honest, bro. They don't trust nobody. If you being caught with something, they're not trusting you, bro. Man, like they told me. Facts. Boxes. The little information that you give them, they're going to take that with a grain of salt. I'm already knowing, bro. Man, you're smarter just from watching all these right. videos, I can just tell, bro. No, sir. They said it was, it's an it's a address that was on there, right? On, what? on the company. On the boxes. On the box? Yeah, right here. Whatever, right here. The boxes. You know, That's and where the, the dope's going? No, no. It's, it, it was coming from a, a company. And they said they, we have, it's a company, you know, and we supply toys. And I was like, okay, it's not anything illegal. I asked them. They said, no, it's not anything illegal. And they just, so why would they you? Me up here, man. See, like, nah, he got too much. calm of a reaction, uh, man. This, 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 this guy. Listen, I'm telling you, I can help you guys. If, if, if you guys can help me, I can help you, please. I'm trying I'm trying to go to my family, too, you know? I understand that. Everybody's trying to go to their families, but there's consequences to the this stuff. I know, but I'm trying to help you guys too, you know, so you can you guys can let me go. Yeah, I don't I don't think it's gonna work out. So you guys are, <laughs> are not gonna cooperate with me here. The guy's yeah, here. Yeah. Where's he at? Nearby. He, right there? He's nearby, I'm telling you. Okay. okay. He's following you? He's not following me. Okay, well how nearby is he? He's in Indy. Okay. So please have you talked to him say, Hey, I'm on my way? What what did you I told him I'm on my way. And what what time was that approximately? Yeah. Was that when I pulled you over? About uh Hour ago. So two hours ago. And then have you been in contact with anybody since? Just been, my, been with my wife and my friend from Virginia. And the moment I come, like you know, it's just stupid comes. So what was in here? What was oh, in the you tell me. I don't know. I mean, bro, I, acting I, like he don't know. Look, it, it came packaged. He's acting know. like he don't know. It looks like drugs. What kind? I don't know, so. So you guys not going through the operation? No. No, sir. He's here. I'm telling you. You guys are not cooperating with me. I'm telling you. I'm you not, like a I'm guy, no. I have nothing to lie about. I'm not calling you a liar. I'm just saying. I, I've been set up straight, and I'm trying to. I'm trying to make this right for for me. You know, because it's not me. You know what I mean? So please, please help me out here. I'm trying to. Oh, yeah, I feel like there's two not, days to have someone in your front seat while you're taking them to jail. From the time I stopped you, your behavior tells me differently. Okay. Sir, I'm telling you, sir, please. I'm telling you, this guy is already here, okay? He's he's waiting, and I'm trying to get get you and get this right, please. I don't I don't want the, I don't want to Indiana go to State I Police. Be, I oh, that's what his thing family. says right here, because my face is covering it. You know, I don't do it, man, you know, you know, I was, I was supposed to just get this and get it done and get my part. Oh, come on. For real, get my part, man. For real, not f***ing this. Doing this for free? Yeah. Uh, my over there, the guy told me, "Hey, this is toys. This is a buddy of mine." And I'm just like, "What? You never asked me that before." This box is weighing about 100 pounds each. You got toys that weigh 100 pounds. I mean, they put it, man. I mean, I didn't touch them. I didn't so you didn't ask? Them. You didn't think box. like, "Hey, what am I moving?" Like, yo. I don't. Know, bro. Huh? I, don't I don't. I didn't even go back. You didn't sleep. I sleep up front. You sleep in the seat. Yeah. Come on, man. Yeah, I sleep in the seat, man. Sometimes I put it back and I sleep. I think this is my first day. It's not your first day, man. I'm pretty sure. But hey, listen, <laughs> this guy's sure. already here. I'm trying to, I'm trying to make this right. So I can, I can, I can take this burden off. So can you call your supervisor again, please? No. Ask him one more time, please. No. Nope. I'm telling you, I can message him, tell him that hey, I got your stuff. Meet me, and then when he meets me, <laughs> you guys get him. So I take my burden off. So you got a curse. I mean, it just doesn't disappear. Yeah. Well, I, that's a lesson learned because. I don't, I, I'm not gonna trust anybody now. Well, it don't work that way, man. I'm trying to, like, please, man. Like, help, like, do something. Tell your supervisor something, man. I'm trying to, it's not me. The drugs weighed about 115 pounds. Vikram pleaded guilty to a felony count of possession with intent to distribute five kilograms or more of cocaine and was sentenced to 78 months in prison, along with. 78 months?
Six and a half years. Eh. Wait. Hold on, let me think, let me think. Let me, let me, let me, let me let it play But four me. years of supervised release. He was also given a $500 fine. Yeah, just throw that $500 fine on there. Six and a half years for moving 115 pounds of that white powder? Nah, I just, I just, but dang, bro, that's a lot. I didn't, honestly, I thought it was going to be 10 plus. I mean, it is 10 plus with supervised, you know. So I'm pretty sure he's not going to be able to truck anymore. So you're going to have to find like a, a regular old job once he get done. Damn. That's crazy. Comment down below what y'all think about it. Uh, if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe. Comment down what you think about it. Make sure you subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. I appreciate you for clicking on this video. Have a wonderful day. Take the description sign now. Peace.